Assalamu alaikum. Welcome all to Easy Human Anatomy channel. In this video, I discuss Fontanelli. What is Fontanelli? Fontanelli is the anatomical features of the infant human skull. They are soft membranous gap between the cranial bones. The number of fontanelles are four. Anterior or frontal fontanelli, posterior or occipital fontanelli, and sphenoidal fontanelli or anterolateral fontanelli, mastoid or posterolateral fontanelli. Fontanelli allows the cuts to deform during birth to easy its passes through the birth canal and for the expansion of the brain after birth. Parents may worry that their infant may be prone to injure at the fontanelli. In fact, the fontanelli is extremely tough and difficult to penetrate. A shrinking fontanelli indicates dehydration and a bulging indicates rise into cranial pressure. Fontanelli allows the infant brain to examine using ultrasonography. Once they are closed, most of the brain is inaccessible to ultrasound imaging because the bony skull presents an acoustic barrier. If the anterior fontanelli is very close, uh, small or close, your visibility will be reduced or completely obscured. Even with a large fontanelli, the peripheral extremity of the brains are obscured from view. The anterior fontanelli. The anterior superior angle of the parietal bone, this part is also known as the bragma. In children, this is known as the anterior fontanelli. So this is anterior fontanelli. It is situated in between frontal suture, coronal suture, and sagittal suture. The shape of the anterior fontanelli is lozenge shape. Its anterior posterior diameter is 4 cm, transverse diameter is 2.5 cm and it is closed at the age of the 12 and 18 month. Ultrasound through anterior fontanelli. When probe is placed uh, along the sagittal uh, suture, the midline structure of the brain can be visualized. This is the medial surface of the cerebrum. This is corpus callosum. This is third ventricle. This is fourth ventricle. This is cerebrum and this is medial surface of the cerebrum showing the sulci and gyri. When probe is placed along the coronal suture, uh, this part of the brain is visualized. Posterior fontanelli. The posterior superior angle of the parietal bone from the lambda in casedal, this part is known as posterior fontanelli in case children. It is triangular in shape and it is situated in between the sagittal suture and lambdoid suture. It is triangular in shape and measurement is less than 1 cm and it is close at the age of 6 to 8 week and delay closure indicate the congenital hypothyroidism. You see here the posterior fontanelli used as acoustic window for our sonography and this part of the brain is visualized mm, through this area. Sphenoidal fontanelli. Um, this is sphenoidal fontanelli and the anterior inferior angle of the parietal bone uh, in case adult is this part is known as the trion. And in case children, this is known as the sphenoidal fontanelli. Sphenoidal or anterior fontanelli is a pair bilateral soft membrane gap at the junction of the coronal suture, the sphenofrontal suture, the sphenoparietal suture, the sphenosquamosal suture, and the squamosal suture. The mastoid fontanelli. The posterior inferior angle of the parietal bone from asterion. In case adult, this part is known as the asterion, but in case children, this is known as the mastoid fontanelli. 
the mustard fontanelle are the pair bilateral soft membranous gap at the junction of the parieto mustard suture the occipito mustard suture and the lambdoid suture the mustard fontanelle persists until the second year of the life after which it is known as the estradiol so here sonography and uh, the probe is placed at the mustard fontanelle and through this area the posterior canal fossa can be visualized the summary is the closure of the fontanelle at flush the posterior fontanelle is closed at the 2 to 3 month after birth then the sphenoidal fontanelle is closed around the 6 month after birth then the mustard fontanelle is closed near the 6 to 18 month after birth and lastly anterior fontanelle is closed 12 to 18 month after birth so this is the lateral uh, this is the x ray of the skull lateral view 5 uh, month old children's x ray and you see the anterior fontanelle and the mustard fontanelle is still parsed but posterior fontanelle and the sphenoidal fontanelle is closed the premature uh, complete ossification of the suture the part of the fontanelle is closed early this condition is known as the craniosynostosis the fontanelle in x ray this is the anterior fontanelle you see this is the the x ray of the 5 month old children and the anterior fontanelle and this is the mustard fontanelle is still present and posterior fontanelle and the phrenoidal fontanelle is obliterated so this is all about fontanelle if you like this video please press the like button and please subscribe my channel